Welcome back to John's Films. Today we're going to learn how to create an encryption decoder effect. Kind of like you see in those spy shows. First thing I need to do is drag a text plus node down onto my timeline. Here it is with the title. And I'll just say encrypted. And I'll use my channel theme font picked out by Mr. Saadi Shah. Good job, Saadi. Thanks, man. And then we'll go to the encrypted word. There we go. I'm going to jump over to my Fusion page, and according to the manual, I shouldn't have to do this, but the edit for it um, is obfuscated, <laughs> to say the least, in the Edit tab. So now I right-click inside of my stylized text, and I go to Text Scramble. Here I can go now up to the top in the modifiers, and this is the only way I've found to get in here. I am going to jack up the randomness. There we go. And you already start to see this is what happens. If I hit the spacebar and play it, it will randomly blow through a whole bunch of characters. This is usable for quite a few things, but at some point we really need to show up with the actual answer, right? To do that, what I'll do is keyframe on my randomness factor. So Here we go. All right. I will start here uh, at extremely scrambled, and I will end up at... not scrambled at all. So to do this, I could, like I've got it right now, just straight through, and it will play and scramble, and gently it will start to descramble a bit of it, start from the left to the right, and there we go. But let's say that you wanted to have it just magically pop at the last second with a decrypted solution. Well, to do that, you might just put another keyframe in right here, and that keyframe, here we go, would be extra scrambled. And so now it will, in one or two frames, pop from crazy to encrypted. And now we can play through it, and we'll see that it is going to be scramble, scramble, scramble. And then here at the end, last second, boom. Let's see if I can stop it on that last frame. <laughs> Missed it. All right, so when it gets to the last second, and then you could, of course, if you wanted to, you could actually say keyframe, move that keyframe over here, move it over here, and then start right here with a perfect non-random solution and then remove that keyframe and now we've got it to where it's going to blow into it going crazy going crazy and all of a sudden pop so this is a cool effect it's something that they've added to the text plus node uh, text plus helper I should say unfortunately it's not accessible from in here that I have found so if you know where it is hey please do let me know where it is uh, otherwise, jump into your Fusion page. You don't have to do too much here, so it's not that scary. Just got to open up that text scramble and right-click inside your input text. All right, thanks for watching, and hope you have a great day.